Then, with the latest arrivals from North Korea as the clock ticks down to the opening ceremony of the 2018 Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang. Two and a half hours ago, almost 300 North Koreans crossed the Customs, Immigration and Quarantine Office at Dorasan Station, just south of the border. Our Ji myung has more on the latest arrivals. A North Korean delegation of 280 members led by Pyongyang Sports Minister Kim Il-gook arrived in South Korea on Wednesday morning. The delegation is comprised of four officials from the North National Olympic Committee, 229 cheerleaders, 26 taekwondo demonstrators and 21 journalists. North Korea's cheering squad, popularly known as Army of Beauties, will be attending and cheering at Olympic matches that have either South or North Korean athletes competing. Their routine includes singing, dancing and sometimes using fans as props to bring out more cheers and excitement among spectators. The North cheerleaders first appeared at the 2002 Asian Games in Busan. The North Taekwondo team will conduct joint performances with South Korean counterparts in the host cities of Pyeongchang and Sokcho, as well as in the South Korean capital of Seoul. On Friday, Pyongyang will send a 22-member high-level delegation to South Korea led by the regime's ceremonial head of state, Kim Jong-nam, for a three-day visit. Kim, who is the head of parliament in North Korea, will attend the Pyeongchang opening ceremony, which will also be attended by U.S. Vice President Mike Pence. Kim will be the highest-level North Korean official to visit the South in four years. While in the South, the high-level delegation will likely attend the United Korean women's ice hockey team's match on Saturday and even possibly meet with President Moon Jae-in. The North participation in the Games is widely seen as a diplomatic maneuver by Pyongyang as it faces growing international pressure and sanctions over its ongoing nuclear and missile provocations. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.